Good morning, folks. We've got a couple cool things to check out here today. Solar activity and a minor eruption. There's an old science joke that's being recycled. There's a study on oxygenation at Europa and a brand new mission from NASA that has me very excited. Let's start with the last 24 hours on our star. While we still don't have much in the way of solar flaring from the sunspots, which are still lacking major size or complexity, there was a filament release on the southern hemisphere near the incoming sunspots. We'll take a closer look at that one here. You can see the coronal signature of the release pretty easily in even the small plasma rope that ejected in here in 304 angstroms. It released southward. The coronagraph images show that most, if not all, of the plasma is going to miss Earth to the south, but a glancing blow cannot be ruled out. We'll see as the weekend approaches if there was an Earth-directed component. Up next, folks. Stop me if you've heard this one before. It seems the Supreme Court decision this week broke brains in the woke center of Colorado, and the thing we have heard so many times before and which has repeatedly failed is now being said once again. Complete clownery. Up next, we're going out to Europa, the moon of Jupiter, where there is a subsurface ocean and scientists have used the hydrogen release measurements to determine how much oxygen is released downward into that ocean. Turns out it's much less than they expected, which brings down the hypothesized oxygenation levels of that ocean with obvious implications for life on that moon. Last but not least, NASA is about to launch a new mission to study the auroral electrojets and see how the magnetic field and space weather electrically couple with the atmosphere. I'm very much applauding this move, especially because as they study space weather, they will get a direct window into the energy deposition directly into our planet, which should break a bunch of aspects of the modern weather models. Best of luck to that mission there. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow right here, but right now it's 5.30 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.